Hey YouTube, USA Second Amendment here with a Christmas ammo video for you guys. I'm sure you can tell that by the title already. But uh, yeah, so Christmas 2013 was uh, really good. We had the entire family over, uh, literally everybody um, at our house. For this, that was the first time ever. Usually we travel and, you know, go everywhere. But uh, anyway, uh, to get right to it, uh, Real quick, just to show you guys, this is sort of a general video too. I don't know if you guys can tell, but uh, if you watch some of my other videos, usually I'm videoing, videoing, videoing in a different location uh, in my house. Um, this was done by my father-in-law. He brought all the wood down and built it right here in the basement. So it's I love this thing. So this is going to be my new uh, my new workbench, and you know. Uh, my gunsmithing bench and gun cleaning bench, uh, my video bench for uh, YouTube, all that good stuff. Um, real quick, he also did a bunch of shelves, organizational stuff. Don't know if you guys can see that real well, but over there we hung a canoe and uh, yeah, hung some tools, stuff like that. But uh, but anyway, um, back to the ammo. So uh, here we'll go left to right. How about that? Uh, my wife. Me, my father-in-law, and uh, actually I have two father-in-laws. Um, her actual dad, not her stepdad, but her actual dad. So me, him, and my brother went in with my uh, together to get my wife a uh, Walther PK380. So uh, he lives, he being uh, my wife's dad, um, he lives in Georgia, and he can go to Georgia Arms. I don't know if you guys can see that there. Georgia Arms. Um, and he got a 500 round can of 380 ACP. Um, flip this open and show you guys just a just an ammo can, just 500 rounds of 380 ACP for her for her new gun. So anyway, and I will be doing a separate review on the Walther PK380, uh, but anyway, I'm not going to get into that in this video, um, but there's 500 rounds of that. I also got her 50 rounds of 380, but we already shot through that. So uh, next, he also got me from Georgia Arms, 9mm, 500 rounds. So just uh, same thing like what you just saw with the 380, just to show you guys. So... My wife loves that these things, that they uh, come in these ammo cans. She loves ammo cans. I don't know why, but like we go in like a store like uh, Bass Pro or Gander Mountain or, you know, Cabela's or even Walmart. And she's like, ooh, ammo cans. It, they don't have to have ammo in them. She just likes ammo cans. So, yeah. So, anyway. So, uh, so we got two more with that. So, that was nice. Um, let's see. My brother got me a box of 9 millimeter. Okay, got me a box of 9mm PMC, obviously he probably found that stuff at uh, Walmart, or at a, actually he found that at a gun store, I'm sorry, uh, same gun store here uh, with these, and it's a box of 22, 325 rounds of the uh, Federal, I like that stuff, um, he also got me two, let's see if you guys can see that, he got me two of... Let's see here. American Eagle 556, 62 grain full metal jacket, obviously. 150 round pack. These have been at Walmart. He found both of these at, at Walmart. Um, I, he actually got me another one uh, a few months back that he said he actually bought them all at the same time. So he just found Walmart when they were in stock. In fact, our Walmart here now is coming back with a lot of 556 and 223 stuff. They're still lacking in the 45, 9 millimeter, 22 categories, 380 categories. But uh, as far as 556, 223 stuff goes, they're, they're getting it back in plentiful now. Um, but anyway, so two of those. Uh, and then he also got me, this is all still from my brother, all of this right here. All this is from my brother. This was my Christmas present, literally. All of that from him. Um, and then two 100 round Winchester white box 45 autos for my 1911. So that was awesome. Uh, for my parents, ooh, look at this. This is a 762 by 54 R, 440 count. Um, so obviously, for those of you that don't know, that goes to a Mosin Nagant. Uh, if you watch one of my other videos, I recently bought a Mosin Nagant from uh, Gander Mountain on Black Friday. 
Uh, however, my parents got me another Mosin Nagant. So look for that video coming up soon. Um, in fact, the one they got me, that, the one I got that my wife convinced me to get on Black Friday is a super nice, clean, awesome gun. The one, and it's a hex receiver. The one that my parents got me is also a hex receiver, but it's even nicer. It's actually from a guy's private collection. Again, I'll get into that in a separate video, but uh, anyway, so uh, so yeah, so there's this. They actually convinced the guy, they found this at a gun, sh at a gun store, at a gun shop, um, and uh, they convinced the guy, or I say convinced the guy, my mom um, was like, well, I want the can opener with it, because um, I don't know if you guys know this or not, but at least this is what the guy in the gun store told her, was that uh, at least for their shipments that they get of this ammo, they don't get a can opener for every uh, box or every can of ammo. They get one can opener per like, I want to say crate or shipment or something. I forget how he worded it, but basically he only had one in the entire store. Um, and uh, my mom being who she is, sweet talked uh, and uh, well, you know, well, she got it. And actually for free, he just said, Merry Christmas, here you go. And, uh, you know, I hope your son enjoys it. So that was really cool. Um, but anyway, so there's that. That's 440 rounds. Now, this is the military surplus ammo, so it is corrosive. Um, I've done a lot of research on that about shooting corrosive ammo. And uh, basically, long as uh, you don't put your gun up and leave it, then you're all right. In other words, clean it with something with ammonia. Again, I'll get into this more with the uh, Mosin Nagant video. Sorry, I'm excited about the Mosin Nagants. But uh, yeah, so that's my ammo video for you guys. Um, it's coming back, like I said, ammo's coming back. I mean, my brother found, he goes uh, where he lives. Um, he actually lives in the Virginia Beach, Norfolk area of, uh, of Virginia. And uh, where he lives within, I wanna say within about an hour, he can hit four or five Walmarts, maybe even more. Um, and he'll hop on his bike. And when I say bike, I mean Harley Davidson. He'll hop on his bike, put on a backpack, and literally just start at one and just ping, 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 and go all the way around and until uh, he hits all the Walmarts. And he's had a lot of luck finding stuff. He's got like, I think he's found like 600 rounds of 9mm for himself. Um, obviously, he's finding all this 5.56 stuff. He's finding 45. Uh, like I said, this 22, that was in a gun store that was not at a Walmart. But, uh... And then Georgia Arms, uh, they actually were at a gun show we just went to, me and my wife. Um, and uh, great, great company. If you guys are ever at a gun show and you get the chance, uh, stop by their booth, Georgia Arms. They're at a lot of the gun shows on the East Coast, and you know, in Georgia, North Carolina, Virginia, uh, so forth and so on. And um, just stop there, and uh, their prices are great. I mean... They're just, they're just great. I mean, just really good prices. I mean, they, they, sometimes they'll beat Walmart prices. You know what I mean? So it's just a uh, great, uh, great prices. But again, Georgia arms, you can look them up online. You can order from them online. In fact, if I remember, I'll put a link below. So, uh, when I post this video so that you guys can actually, uh, go to their website, you can order from them online. Um, if something's not in stock, you can, uh, I'm pretty sure you have to look at the website, but I'm pretty sure you can have them, uh, email you for when it's in or something like that. Um, they have seconds. Like you see on here, this box is act is actually seconds. Uh, that he got for my wife for the 380 ACP. Um, he said simply because it's just freaking expensive. I don't know why 380 ACP is that expensive. It shouldn't be more than nine millimeter, but it is for whatever reason, I guess because there's just not that much of it, not as much as a uh, nine millimeter. So uh, anyway, yeah, if you guys have any questions or comments, let me know, uh, leave them below and uh, hope you guys had a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year.